You mentioned Limo Anywhere Academy, which is coming up in September, and you said you're going to make some announcements there. Can you tell the people here that may be on the fence of deciding if they want to come or are not planning on coming, kind of tell us about Limo Anywhere Academy and why they need to be there? Yeah, sure. So let me take a step back. So, and maybe some of you saw my post on Facebook with the, the, the glamorous arms unfolded in front of Sundance Square as a jest. Um, but I, I did mention in that long um, email, or, or sorry, a Facebook message post that, you know, it's, it's very apparent to us, and, and we've actually done research on this to back it up, that a very large percentage of our customers use a, a much smaller percentage of our software than we would um, ideally like to see. And I think that they should um, exploit, given that every feature and function that we've designed is intended to either save money or time um, or drive new revenue. And so if we're talking about um, 30 to 40%, uh, of a hundred percent, that's a fairly small amount of, of, of um, functionality that um, um, some of our customers are are using on a day to day basis. And so, I mean, to put an analogy on it, I mean, would you buy a sprinter, a new sprinter, and only use thirty to forty percent of of the functionality or the features that became available as part of the the package um, that you that you um, uh, acquired for for your your client base um, probably not so why should software in this case be be any different um, we we want our customers to truly elevate their game and adopt and embrace the entire platform so I can't personally tell you how many times at events I've been at um, in the industry for the last two years where virtually every time I'm at an event somebody will come up to me and say I was at the booth <clears throat> I just learned of this great tip or trick that alone, justified my entire visit to chauffeur driven or lct or whatnot and that was a five minute exchange at our booth i mean imagine what a, a day and a half of immersive training on every feature and function um, that we have available through limo anywhere um, could do for for our clients business it's kind of piggybacking on that i would say you know we polled our customers um, and and have heard repeatedly that more training deeper training um, dedicated training is is an area that we need to improve so while you know we will continue to provide multiple channels and sources for, for ad hoc consumption of training material, and that's never going to stop. We'll always do that. We really believe the best practice and widely adopted in um, virtually any industry um, that I've come across or been part of uh, in software is a user conference for, for ensuring that people can really take a day or two out of their time to explore and understand all of the intricacies and ways in which not only can they use a module better, but how you can optimize the use of all of the modules to work more um, collaboratively together. So, uh, you know, I'll give you an example and then pass it back to you. Um, it's just kind of a string of consciousness, but we talk repeatedly with customers about the importance and need for distance-based rates or criteria-based rates in certain cases because it helps maximize your coverage. Um, and your revenue, because you want to always have a rate displayed. You don't want to always lean on a quote necessarily, it's particularly in the online space where people can bail in two seconds. Um, that's one element of value, just learning how to best optimize and construct those types of rates in various types of scenarios or hybrid rates. But you can also, obviously, or need to also ensure that that ties to the right service types, vehicle types, um, that can help improve your merchandising, um, particularly online. Uh, Providing accurately displayed merchandising in ORES and in your instant rate lookup can improve your conversion rates, right? Um, automatically pre populating and reservation screens can help you save you time. So, that's we really spend a lot of time with this new instant rate module. And very few knew or know that not only is it somewhat of an AI component that detects what you're typing to know what rates to populate, for instance, an airport shows an airport rate or a corporate client ID shows a corporate client rate, you can take all that information and seamlessly port it into a reservation now and save significant time for your reservation agents. Further, you can use the DA statuses to trigger scheduled messages, which again, can save you time in that very end, end workflow I'm talking about. And then lastly, leveraging reporting and analytics to understand the channel performance. So understanding how your online channel is doing versus your offline channel, 
and what needs to be tweaked so that you can optimize is critically important. So each module in of itself is important in exploiting the, the best, to the best of your ability, every, every capability within that module, but also calibrating all the modules together to ensure that um, they're working um, in the way that best suits your business to, to really uh, maximize your profits. I mean, that's, that's, that's where I think um, the rubber hits the road and, and where a lot of our, our customers um, could use some help based on my experience and my observations.